Hello, this is boy Gemuzi. Today we talk about Julius Nyerere of Tanzania, one of the great leader. I mean, this man was visionary leader. They see something far ahead, so he do a lot of grand work. Julius Nyerere, he served as a president twenty one years. That's a long time, but he's a great leader. An Africanist. He believed in everything in Africa. He believed Africa we can do better for ourselves. So Julius Nyerere is a great visionary leader in that region. So a lot of people admire him. They follow his footsteps also. So as yesterday we talked about Kwame Kuman of Ghana. So today I take you to the East Africa which is Tanzania, the great leader of Jesus Nyerere. He's a wonderful man. I mean, that man do a lot of things. He do a lot of groundwork, a lot of things of Jesus Nyerere. Just read about him. If you have the time, just read about this man. This man was a great man. He do a lot of good things, you know. These are the people behind the brain of Africa. All what they want, they believe that we can, we can do better for ourselves without anyone. And the lady foundation now is up to us, we as a younger generation, now to belong on that great foundation so that we as an African, we can stand on our own, we can do something for ourselves. And I believe Africa will do that. We will create our own economic zone, free trade, better infrastructure between the continent. So these are all the things bring sustainable development. If we have a better infrastructure, industrial, and all of these things will bring better economy so that our continent will grow so we can be able to move around. I mean, as an African, we don't need a visa. If I want to go to South Africa, why I need a visa to go to South Africa? Or if I want to go to Tanzania, why do I need a visa as an African? We don't need that. They need to put things in place so that we don't need visa. We need to walk around as an African. We need to walk around the continent. So I feel like these are the barriers which really disturb African progress. So I hope and pray our leaders will see some of these things as a something which is not supposed to be there. We need to travel around. Kudos to Ghana, by the way, because I see Ghana and South Africa already make, they sign a memorandum so that they don't need this thing. So I hope other African countries, they will tap into this because we need this one. So I don't want to make the video long. So today we talk about Julius Nyerere, the great visionary leader of Tanzania. He served 21 years in government. May he so rest in peace, but that man do a lot of good things. So I hope and pray our leaders will really, really tap into this and sign a memorandum between the continent I'm not just saying East Africa or West or not. All of, when I say all the African continent, we need to be move around freely and do.